I want to take you outside because we have been actually looking at, um, well, look at this view from the uh, IPL building where we have that shamrock as the town continues to be painted green. We actually have a few flurries that are flying around at this point. We've been uh, noticing them uh, uh, occasionally on this camera so we know that the snow has made it into the Indianapolis metro it's been really impacting most of the states uh, while you are sleeping perhaps you're just waking up getting your Sunday started the snow has arrived and it will continue through most of the day good news is it's really not going to amount to much potentially some slick spots up to an inch if you get it underneath one of those uh, heavier bands but it's all going to melt away as we get into the afternoon we'll get back into the mid 40s and this changes over to rain so from Kokomo to Tipton Still picking up on some moderate snow bands now. We head a little farther to the south, and that's where the uh, snow continues across the southern part of the state. Quick clipper system moving through this morning, and then uh, we are not expecting much on the backside of this. So as soon as it makes its way through, it's going to be uh, just about it for what we're expecting today. Temperatures starting off below freezing, but we get back into the mid-40s this afternoon. And as far as when that transition happens from snow back over to rain, Looks like mainly after lunchtime today between about 12 and 2 p.m. So here's the latest timeline. We take you through the morning hours today. This stays an all snow event for us, especially as we get uh, up to uh, places north like uh, Muncie to Kokomo up to Marion over to Richmond. Already looking at the 40s making their return where the sky will actually uh, break from the clouds a little bit. 44 degrees at noon in Terre Haute. We all get back into the 40s this afternoon. Scattered rain showers continue off and on through 6 p.m. And then everything kind of clears out as we get into the evening overnight tonight. Snowfall potential, again, not going to be uh, all that impressive through the state. Most of us pick up less than an inch, perhaps a dusting. Just enough to create some slick areas on untreated surfaces. Up to an inch there, that swath from Noblesville, potentially to Tipton and Lafayette. And then again, this all melts away. 46 degrees today and your high tomorrow, but temperatures continue to climb as we get closer to the first day of spring. We'll go 54 high on Tuesday with a quick rain event moving in on Wednesday for the first day of spring. Happens on March 20th, so just a few days away now. Now what happens is we have the equinox that takes place. So in theory, we have equal hours of daytime and light time. But uh, here in Indianapolis, and just depending on where you are latitudinally, uh, you have a few minutes, give or take, that equal daylight time. So we'll go 12 hours and 8 minutes of daylight for the first day of spring for us here in central Indiana with a normal daytime high of 54, normal low of around 34, and we're going to be right there near 50. So pretty seasonal as we get through the middle part of the week. We ring in first few days of spring with actually warmer than average temperatures. 55 on Thursday, 58 next Friday. And Alyssa, we get into next weekend with sunshine and a high of 63.